Hello, everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're celebrating another prominent character in the Deadpool series Wade's Sugar Bear, himself, Peter. Yes, he's back. Fans and Deadpool alike are glad to see this character return for the new movie, played by Rob Delaney. We first see Peter in Deadpool 2, when he successfully signs up for X Force. Those things go very fast. Oh my god, what the? It's Peter. After Vanessa, it's Wade who goes back to save him at the end of the movie. So, what makes him the true hero of Deadpool and Wolverine? In a world filled with mutants and over-the-top personalities, Peter's simplicity is a breath of fresh air. He's just an average guy who happens to stumble into this chaotic world and is willing to stand shoulder to shoulder with Deadpool despite his lack of powers. This is precisely what makes his heroism so compelling. He has no real desire to be anything more than the guy who can help. Unlike Dopinder in Deadpool 2, Peter isn't looking for glory. He joins X-Force because he thought it looked fun, which is precisely why he is hired. Peter's earnestness is another key factor. His presence serves as a grounding force for Wade. He works a standard 9, 2, 5 job, looks on the bright side, and reminds Wade of the importance of heart and humanity amidst the violence and chaos. He is a true friend. Though he knows Wade's true purpose in life, he supports him through his identity crisis, getting him a job selling cars while trying to coax Deadpool back out by reminding him of all the good he does. This unyielding hope, innocence, and enthusiasm remind Wade of what it means to be human and to find joy in the simplest things. No superpowers at all, uh, I have both type 1 and 2 diabetes. Peter's journey also serves as an inspirational arc for the audience. His character represents the idea that you don't need superpowers to be a hero. This theme is especially resonant in a superhero film where the focus is usually on extraordinary abilities. Peter's story is a refreshing reminder that courage, heart, and a willingness to do what's right are what truly make a hero. His friendship and support make him an honorable being for all Deadpools and all universes, and he is the only one that can stop the entire core from finishing our Earth. Wade Wilson isn't the only one who sees the good in Peter. At the end of Deadpool and Wolverine, having saved our heroes from being Julian, he comes to their aid once more, confirming they are variants of his Earth's timeline. At this point, he's still dressed as Peter Poole, which catches the eye of Hunter B. 15, a.k.a. Dr. Variety Willis of the TVA. Peter getting the girl is a standard hero trope in any action movie but the manner in which it happens is so far removed from the standard that it adds an extra layer of wholesomeness to his character. He may not have superpowers, but Peter's courage and heart make him the true hero of the movie. Thanks for watching.